Alright guys, welcome back. As you guys have already seen, we're working with the cows today. We're uh, selling our calves. So we had to get the whole herd into the one um, little barnyard there, what we call barnyard number two. Uh, and then we sorted all the cows out. Um, Away from the calves so that just left the calves in barnyard number two and then we uh, got the calves up into the one uh, round or not round pen holding pen that we have and then uh, we were able to backtrack them up the chute back into the main holding pen and then we were able to get them up into the alleyway um, where we had the trailer waiting uh, to uh, load them on. So once we got them loaded, we were able to pull away and now we're just driving down the road and we're taking them to uh, the in-laws and we'll weigh them and they'll go out into one of their barnyards. So, anyway, that's what we're up to right now. It's, uh, as you can see, there's a bit of a bead of sweat on me. She's a little touch and go there for a bit. Uh, just trying to deal with calves. If any of you guys have ever farmed and dealt with calves, you know what I'm talking about. Cows you can kind of work with, but calves, Pretty much impossible anyway so but we got them all on we got uh, 12 on this load so now we're gonna back up we already got we had already gone over earlier and set up the um, chute that has the uh, built-in uh, scale. scale so now we're gonna offload them into the tub and then we'll run them down the chute into the scale get individual uh, weights on them and then let them loose uh, into the other barnyard. Alrighty, so this is the trailer full of calves that we got. And this is the arrow quip chute. So this is what they call a tub is this uh, round pen so that gate there can actually slide all the way around and then it has a locking arm that catches on these bars that are welded on the side of the tub so it allows you to kind of squeeze them through then you got the scale right here and this is a door, so you just close that when you only want, once you get a calf on there. So then you get your weight, and then this door lets it, you go through into the head gate. And then we'll put them in the head gate, we'll tag them and deworm them. And then we'll let them loose into that pen there. So, anyway. what we got going on all right so we've uh, we've done about half the calves so far exactly half. exactly half yes I figured I'd show you guys them in the tub here and then we got the uh, scale set up there so that gives you your reading and then we're marking down the number their weight and whether it's a steer or heifer so, I'm going to just put you guys up here. Well, you can run it while I... Okay. So, they walk onto the scale. And then it gives you a readout. 522. So, that's their weight. It's a steer. 
just gonna set you up here. Would be the sound of calves being weaned. Anyway, got all the gear uh, packed up and hauled out of the barnyard there. Now we're just uh, cleaning it up. We uh, we already cleaned out the uh, stock trailer, so now Jess is just in there hosing out the uh, scale. It's amazing how dirty this stuff can get in such a short time with very few animals. It doesn't take long and there's lots of crap and everything else. So anyway, got her all uh, cleaned up up front here. This is stored outside anyway, so it'll see a lot of rain and everything anyway. So, but we'll just get the most of the manure out of it. So, anyway guys, um, that's going to do it for this little video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If so, you know what to do. Hit that thumbs up button. And if you guys enjoy watching uh, our channel, make sure you guys subscribe so you guys don't miss any new content coming out. Um, if you're new to the channel, it's just a lot of farming, trapping, hunting, uh, just outdoor stuff. Um, so yeah, up in Northern Ontario, so like I said, and make sure you guys uh, leave us a comment, let us know what you guys are thinking, and uh, let us know if we're doing a good job, and until next time guys, ciao.